Let's look at Chapter Six: Long Distance Networks. In the design for long distance networks, we have to take into consideration of different factors, like here listed, and、uh, we also. Being a system designer, must specify different type of traffic, survivability, etc. These kind of parameters we have to take into consideration as well. Of course, above above all, we have to、uh, consider the economy. And here, just the、uh, the list of the general、uh, considerations. We have also we need to look at、uh, how the structures or the layers of、uh, switching office we have to、uh, design based on many different factors. We should have at least the local office, the very bottom ones, and then. Tandem office and then tow office for long distance and、uh, switch traffic around、uh, different central offices. Or also need to look at the exchange placement where to put the switches, and we need to construct the traffic matrix. Etc. And here we have the link limitation. We know that、uh, we should not have、uh, more links than is is recommended because that would decide the quality of the voice、uh, communication. I mean, if we have too many links, then the delay would、uh, increase. We know that、uh, each additional link get involved in a end-to-end -end channel. We would introduce certain amount of delay, which is not very desirable. And when we design international networks, we have to follow the rules here. The exchange or switch location. First of all, we have to divide、uh, a country into different uh, toll uh, areas. Just like here in U.S., we have a different area code. Each area code is used in one specific、uh, toll area. And how to design or to decide the size? Of the toll area, have to、uh, take many factors into consideration, like、uh, the ones we list here. Also, know that、uh, we need to、uh, take into consideration of existing network because existing network contain a lot of、uh, investment, so we don't want to throw that away. Just to make a way for the new network. No, we just try to integrate it into the new network. S S seven is the standard we use here. Actually, in this country, it's the most popular single link system for analog、uh, telephone networks. Traffic routing. We need to know different kind of routing、uh, method. And also, when we do need the transmission about the long distance telephone network, we need to、uh, look at the propagation because propagation that would cause a delay, processing time for the switches, and also need to minimize the impact from、uh, echoes and the signal which made the conversation uncomfortable, if not. Uh, control uh, under certain level.
Of course, we also need to look at the transmission loss plan or the link budget because we need to have the minimum uh, output to meet the requirement to have a decent uh, quality. In order to do so, we have to uh, look at the attenuation over the telephone line, and then we might have to put a certain kind of uh, certain amount of uh, voice amplifier to boost the power to maintain the minimum output level.